What is going on guys, this is Do Shop, and I've asked a lot of streamers around the world, what is your favorite streaming device? What is the one thing that you can't live without when it comes to streaming? And a lot of them will say it's the Elgato Stream Deck. Well, I'm gonna tell you today, I'm gonna unbox something that's better than the Elgato Stream Deck. It's the Elgato Stream Deck Plus. Let's go. All right, guys, before we get started, make sure you hit stick that like button, subscribe to the channel as I'll have more Stream Deck videos coming out real soon. I wanna do a tutorial on a bunch of things about the Stream Deck that we don't even know about or that we're gonna discover together. Look, I'll be the first to admit, I have a Stream Deck XL and a Mini that you see here, but I don't use them to my full capability. There are capabilities of this Stream Deck beyond the things that you think that we can do or some of the things that you're probably doing. I bet you a lot of streamers out there have Stream Decks or something like this, but are not using it to do a bunch of automations that will make your life easier when it comes to streaming. So that's what we're gonna do in these next set of videos. Um, after I um, do this unboxing, we'll do how to set it up, how to install plugins, what plugins you should do, you should install first, and then we'll get into some of the automations and some of the things in particular, very specific things that we can do to make our lives easier as a streamer. And that's what I wanna do. And so let's go ahead also, 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 I want to give a shout out to Elgato for sending me this Stream Deck Plus uh, so that I can show it off and unbox it and teach you guys how to use it as well as teach me a little bit as well. So let's go ahead and open this thing up. All right, move this to the side. Some of the things that it has on the box, um, it was like round, um, has eight customizable LCD keys, four multifunctional dials, dynamic touch strip, single and multi actions, detachable cable uh, and stream deck store. And we'll get into all of that, especially like the software and how to use the software. So let's put this box to the side. Um, we'll go ahead and open this real quick. And then here we have the stream deck quick start guide. Um, and then we have a little guide in a bunch of languages. So we'll definitely be referring to this stream deck quick start guide in a bit, but let's go ahead and lift this bad boy up. And wow, the one thing I will say about a lot of these Elgato products is they don't feel fake. They don't feel cheap. Like this is very solid. Um, it has padding on the bottom uh, so that it doesn't scratch your desk. And we'll move this to actually looks like it has something else in here. Okay, so we have a uh, USB-A to USB-C type cables right here. We'll move this to the side real quick. So let's see what we have here. I mean, like I said, it, it looks solid. Eight buttons here. I'm I'm guessing this is the touch strip has dials here as well. The cool thing right off the bat is that these dials you can press in. So I'm guessing, and I've seen a couple of videos about this. I try not to look at a whole bunch of videos when it came to the Stream Deck Plus because I wanted to kind of like formulate my own opinions about it and be able to go through it myself. But I did see where you can press these buttons and what I'm guessing is that you could probably cycle through options and be able to turn this stuff up. Um, but yeah, I mean, this this looks very solid. Okay, so back here is the USB um, outlet. This is where you plug in your USB-C. I feel like this is in a bad spot. I mean, maybe I would like it on the side because I feel like it may bend the USB-C, but actually, you know what? Elgato thinks of everything. Like this lays perfectly across the back. There's no bending at all on this. I thought it was gonna be too far underneath and that this was gonna maybe bend the USB-C, but you can see right here that it doesn't, that it kind of lays right along the back and you can make it in the back. That way you can have it on your desk and not see any wires on the side, which is great, which is great. So, I mean, man, again, this feels very solid. I've seen streamers be able to, and, and when I talk about like some of the functions that you can do as a streamer, I'm not even talking about like, for, you know, making sounds or whatever, because I'm thinking, I'm, I'm thinking like right off the bat here that I would probably use this for a lot of my functions, but like my, my Stream Deck XL, I might just use for a soundboard because it has so many buttons and I'll be able to just 
press any buttons I want. Um, but this I feel like, man, I feel like because there are, there are dials, I feel like because there's a touch strip and there's buttons, I feel like there's a lot of capabilities in this thing uh, that we haven't even scratched the surface of. And so we'll be doing that in our next few videos. And I want to say also that I also know that I'm not getting rid of my Stream Deck Mini. I'm not getting rid of my Stream Deck XL. Like this is just going to go with it. These, this is going to be a companion or actually the other two will be a companion to this. So if you already have a Stream Deck and you're trying to wonder, you know, should I get a Stream Deck XL to replace the Stream Deck that I already have? Maybe you want to just keep the Stream Deck XL I mean, and the Stream Deck Plus or the Stream Deck Mini and the Stream Deck uh, Plus or the Stream Deck MK and the Stream Deck Plus. Because I can definitely see where this can be a whole set of things and then you can use your, your Stream Deck, your other Stream Deck for some other things. So again, shout out to Elgato for producing such a great product. Make sure you hit stick that like button, subscribe to the channel. We'll be back with more. Stream Deck um, tutorials for you guys. And as always, I appreciate it. Also in the comment section, let me know if you already have a Stream Deck and which one you have and what do you use it for? Is there something that you feel like you're missing? I hope we uncover that when we do these videos. So I appreciate you guys. This should do shop out, peace.